Hey guys, Amanda Helly, DJ Iceberg 365, anchor for RYC Praise News. First up, Hip Hop Radio is a platform to create an avenue for positive rap music. They feature and play the dopest indie artists on this side of heaven. Music will be aired on FM and internet radio. Check out Tuesdays at 8.30 p.m. Eastern. And check out more at facebook.com slash hhradio and the number one. Next up, Ellie and Grace. Their mission is to provide the softest, highest quality Christian apparel designed to uplift, inspire, and point others to Jesus. Here's what they had to say. We were founded in 2016 by Brenna, and she still designs the shirts and runs the company with her husband today with the help of an amazing team. Brenna says, when I started Ellie and Grace in my basement in 2016, I never could have imagined what God would create. Thank you so much for shopping small and supporting our business. Each design is created with you in mind, whether you're needing some encouragement, going through a rough patch, or looking for the perfect gift. Thank you for choosing to shop at Ellie and Grace. I hope each item you purchase helps uplift and inspire you and those that see you wear it. Find out more at E-L-L-Y and Grace.com. Last up, Lasso and A Ward clean up on the Champion of the Year. The fifth annual Champion of the Year took place recently, and two of CHH's finest walks, walked away with some prized accolades and bragging rights. For those who don't know, Champion of the Year is an award that's given to the best battle rapper who performed the best in that particular year. Champion of the Year, or COTY, is the brainchild of battle rap media personality J Block. The award was meant to incentivize battle rappers to do their best all year long and to uplift the battle rap culture and community as a whole. 2021 was a great year for battle rap and the seven and a half hours spent debating in the top 20 battle rappers in the world are proof of that. Lasso, who battled 12 times that year, ended up in the number nine spot. He originally landed the number eight spot, but a shift happened that caused all the battle rappers to move down one spot. That's not all that Lasso left with. The fans voted his second round against Vixen the Assassin as the round of the year. His battle against Vixen took place back in March, but the battle rap culture as a whole has been talking about that round for the rest of the year. Congrats to Lasso on his placement and his award. Each pan panelists on the COTY panel has their own top 20 battle rap list and the whole panel debates to settle the overall top 20. In Jay Black's own words, 16 is the new 20. What he means by that is that after the names are placed on the top 20 list, there are several shifts that happen. It's been his experience that at least four to five shifts happen during the course of their discourse. That means if you're number 16, you have just as much of a chance as being booted off the list as number 20. You really aren't safe unless you're number 15 and higher. All that to say this, as the panelists approach the top five, the debates got intense. At one point where there was an argument trying to wait rank a ward above to surf the fact that ward and rum nitty could have been interchangeable at numbers four and five and so many other arguments when the smoke cleared a ward had made it that coveted top five spot as number five while many may take issue with this ward is still listed as the number five battle rapper in the world with 23 battles under his belt 2021 has shown the world what most CHH fans knew already. Lasso and Award are two of the best battle rappers in the world, and they just so happen to be Christians. Although Vibe Magazine failed to do so, this writer wants to acknowledge all the hard work that J Block has put into COTY for half a decade. This man did it all from raising the money, camera work, securing the venue, paying for the belt and the ring, to so many other behind the scenes efforts. It takes a lot to pull off an event of this magnitude consistently and in excellence. You can read more at trackstars.com. The mission of RYC Praise News is to bring the world good news about God and uplift our brothers and sisters in a good word. We come to you in multiple different ways, music, news, reporting, podcasts, and artwork. We are here to lift up the word of God. We have a live 365 station for RYC Praise News. Check it out at bit.ly slash RYC Praise News. Submit music, podcasts, DJ mixes, and artwork to rycpraisenews at gmail.com. Drop our Facebook page a like at facebook.com slash rycpraisenews and subscribe to RYC Praise News on YouTube. Follow us on Twitter at NewsRYC and Instagram and TikTok at RYC Praise News.
I hope you enjoyed my report this week. Share this video and leave story suggestions for next time down in the comments. I'm DJ Iceberg 365 for RYC Praise News. I'll see you next week.